Hi, I'm Jacinta, and today we're going to be making a Barbie dream house in Animal Crossing. No, this is not it behind me, but how cute. We are on the Happy Home Paradise Island, though, and today we are going to decorate for a very cute pink villager, Flora. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to lose my cute pink outfit to do this build, which is really sad. But at least I've still got the blonde hair. Now, I'm going to Amiibo Flora in. And no, her request is not a Barbie dream house. But too bad, that's what she's going to get today. <laughs> I just thought she'd be perfect for this idea. So she brings with her some pink flamingos and a pink sofa. I'm definitely going to be using the pink flamingos in this build. I'm doing a two level home because I'm basing this off the main Barbie dream house in the Barbie movie and that one is two stories. So to start with these happy home paradise yards really aren't big enough. Let's just try it there and we want to make it a nice big house. I think we'll go with that one. Now of course we need a pink roof. I think we're gonna have to go with the brighter pink. That's quite a nice bright purple, but I think I'm gonna go for the pink bricks. Okay, that's what we've got to start with. Now I've downloaded some really cool custom designs. As you can see, they're obviously all pink and white. Very on brand for a Barbie build. Oh, they're actually all so nice. Now I just wanna do a road coming down the front. That is cute. Then we've got a pool design, but I really don't know if I've got enough room for this. I also don't really know how to use this design. I chose to do this build in Happy Home Paradise because I knew it would be a lot easier. I wouldn't have to DIY, make all the items, but it is definitely a smaller yard than if I had done it on my own island. I also wanted to use the swimming pool item. That also may not fit. Or maybe I'll only be able to fit that and not the custom design. Actually, while I'm looking through the items, I'm going to pull out some that I think would be good for this build. Just so I've got them all laid out and that may help me with ideas. So yeah, I was thinking of using this, but it is rather large. It fills up that whole space. But I could use it and just get rid of this blue custom design. I think that's what we're going to have to do. I might even try the white pool tires because that matches with the pool a bit better. Okay, now for the dream house. I wanted... <laughs> I've put all these items in the way now. Why have I done this? Now, I wanted to use the simple panels to expand the house and make it look two-story, but... We haven't got too much room, so this may be difficult. How do people do this? I'm so bad at doing buildings. Hmm. Okay, these are our options. Now, I wanted to also get a medieval building side because there's this pink version. Not sure if that really looks like a two-story house, but it might be the best we're going to get. I love these palm tree lamps. They're so pretty. Now to fill in the gaps. We definitely need some kind of fruity drink next to this pool. There was a lot of yellow and pink in Barbie land, so I might do a yellow stool just to bring a new color into this build so it's not all pink. I really wish I could fit an item there. Would it look good if I moved the pool forward one space? That could work. Now I thought about bringing this item in in case we couldn't really fit many trees in this build. We could use the cherry blossom version of this to bring in some more pink if we didn't have enough. Oh and I definitely want one of these flamingos because in the movie the letterbox is a flamingo which is so cute. Actually I like this one with the legs up more. Looks a bit more fun. I might change the colour of this ramp to be the white one. And as for this bridge, no, not you, Flora. Hmm, none of them really suit. No, how annoying. I almost feel like that one suits the most. I wish there was a pink one. I did want a car as well, but we were really running out of room here. But I did download a cool Barbie logo. We could use that. It's not a very nice car, but we could put it here because I don't mind blocking off the ramp. Oh my gosh, stop. Anything that makes this build look more plastic is perfect. Right, 
How's that looking? Pretty good. You can't go up the back ramp, but that's fine. Yeah, this is looking good. Okay, let's head inside. So the inspo for this is obviously the Barbie dream house from the movie. She's got a kitchen on the right hand side and then a lounge on the left hand. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So the walls and the floors are like a really bright pink, which I don't think I'm going to have the right shade. I could customize the glow in the dark stickers to be bright pink. Ooh, that could maybe work. If only I had a whole wall the same color as the bottom, that would be perfect, but we might not find the perfect wall. Oh, that's cute, but not what we're going for. I think that wall with this plain pink flooring is all right. Now I could do a partition wall for like the middle of the room because there's this kind of fireplace thing. Can you do custom wallpaper on an accent wall? Oh, you can. Oh, that's gonna do the whole wall though. Oh, we could use custom designs on the whole wall. I don't even need the glow in the dark stickers. <laughs> See, we could do that, but there's no windows. I did quite like that My Melody wallpaper. Maybe we could do it as an accent wall. Oh, and then that stays plain pink. Okay, I do quite like that. That breaks up the room a bit. We might have to do a wallpaper with windows. It's not pink, but it brings a lot more light in. And because the whole house is plastic, like you can see into it. So I think that makes sense. Now they've got lots of fun colored drinks on the counter in the photo. That one definitely looks fun. This one's definitely fun. This could be fun for some more color. I don't know if I want two counters. I think I'd rather remove the chairs from the counters and have a bit more space around everything. Now we definitely want that for the lounge side because there is a lamp in the shot. I'm gonna add some greenery because in the movie there's no wall on the side of the house, which we unfortunately can't do. But let's make it look a little bit lighter and brighter. Now I need a fun couch and a fun coffee table. Hopefully we've got some good couch options. I think we have to go for the cute one. Now this pink heart rug is perfect. Do we want it in the kitchen or the lounge? Now of course we need some shoes at the door even though the villagers don't wear shoes. Now some stuff for the walls to jazz it up a little bit. else can we hang from the roof oh we've got this the pastel one's really cute hanging in front of that's quite nice could put this on the wall yeah that's cute i mean it looks nothing like the movie but <laughs> i've done my best now let's go upstairs all right the bedroom they do wake up in the morning and like wave to each other so i kind of want there to be a lot of glass so i could use this again and then maybe this is an accent wall for the floor maybe we could go white this time and do more rugs i want like a plush white carpet but i don't seem to have one we're just gonna have to go with this so her bedroom will be quite simple we obviously need a bed and i have to use the shell bed because she sleeps in a shell bed so that is cute and so perfect we could give her a ring light she like looks through her mirror and that actually looks like it She liked that color more. The pink was a bit of a weird pink. Oh, there's a pink chandelier. Okay, we need that for sure. That is so cute. Like, this is pretty, but it's not giving me Barbie movie vibes. But I mean, I've only done what I can with what we've got here. Done my best. I really wish I had the wedding flowers because I feel like they would be so cute on the walls. But unfortunately, I mustn't have them unlocked. flooring it she looks better now let's barbieify flora <laughs> i mean her dress she's already wearing is cute but i do really like that pink checkered one what a cutie 
All right, I think we're all done. So let's talk to Flora and check out our entire Barbie dream house build. Well, that is my Barbie dream house build all done. I hope you like it. It does not look like the real Barbie dream house kind of at all. <laughs> it's more inspired by it. I did my best, but I love how it turned out. It's super cute and it was a really fun build. So highly recommend it. Thanks for watching. Bye.